Hey, good morning. Chuck here with Apple Drains. You know, adding a drain to your driveway sometimes is very simple. Um, as you can see from this drive, steep drive, water comes down the hill, and you can see where it just lays there in the driveway. But you could put a channel drain across here. Rather costly um, investment into the con cutting concrete and installing this channel drain, or you could just put a catch basin at the side of the drive. This is by far the best thing to do. You can see how the concrete has cracked over the years, grass has grown up. This is because water is sitting underneath of the concrete. That's what causes the crack. There's movement in the concrete. So if we can get a drain that sits a little below the driveway concrete and allow that water to you know, run off and drop into the drain, as you can see, we've got our catch basin set down about an inch or so below the lowest point of that concrete. It'll pick that water up and it'll just run right off to the side. This job has a great downhill run. We've installed the pipe and you know basically covering it up. Here where it discharges at the end of the line, we just cut the pipe off at an angle and you're done. So originally the homeowner had installed a small uh, little tiny six by six drain here with an atrium grate. Atrium grates are grates that rise up to help keep debris from clogging them. Um, but the line ran uphill pretty badly. So basically what we're doing is we're installing a new drain with better downhill flow to solve the problem. A really simple job. And save, you know, five, six, seven, eight hundred dollars. Granted, we are using a trencher. It's summertime here in Charlotte, North Carolina. And this ground is very hard. That red clay, when it dries out, wow, is it hard. Even the trencher has a hard time getting down into the soil. But you know, you can use a pick, a shovel, you could even rent a trencher and save yourself quite a bit of money. What a great project for the do-it-yourselfer. Remember, you could put a channel drain across the drive. That involves cutting the drive, removing concrete, repouring concrete, a lot of work. If you've got downhill flow away from that driveway, this is the way to go. Our total materials on this job were less than $60. And, you know, it took us about 35, 40 minutes. Granted, we have a crew, but what a great afternoon project or weekend project for yourself and the satisfaction of doing something yourself. Simple and easy project. Just don't forget to locate those utilities before you dig. Hey, this is Chuck with Apple Drains reminding you that if you believe you can do something, I guarantee you can do it. Have a great day.